Good evening. Today is Sunday, what is it, June 4th, I think, 2023. And uh, I'm out here working my little side hustle, working with Instacart. Had a nice little batch, they just dropped me. Surprised me. But anyway, back to the topic that I have for today. I'm gonna rub some people the wrong way with this one, I know, especially my people, which is black people. But this message is to black people. It's time to let the Democrat party go. <laughs> Y'all still there? <laughs> it's time to let the Democrat party go, man. They have been selling us out ever since I've been born. But it's like we're too scared to say anything because I guess we would be an outcast. But anybody that knows me knows that I'm gonna speak the truth. I don't care who don't like it. If I believe it to be true, you know, if I find out otherwise, then I come back and apologize and say how I, I, I was wrong. But I ain't wrong about this one. And if you look back over our history, as far as black people being Democrats, I was like, it was just automatic when I was born that that what I was because everybody, my whole family, everybody was just Democrats. I had no experience with them or nothing they ever done for us, nothing they ever done to help us, but I was just, a, you know, a Democrat just because. So as I got older, I'm starting, I'm, I'm peeping things out, right? And I'm like, damn, we, we automatically vote Democrat every election especially the presidential election, and what do we get? We get nothing. Now, they ha they hand us a little, like, the, you know, they're good for, like, welfare, you know, st food stamps, or public assistance, stuff like that. But I ain't saying that there's, there's not people that need that sometimes. At one point in time, I need the help. But what they do is, they don't let you get the help for a little while. They want you dependent on that shit. And what that does is, I don't know if you ever heard this saying, that if you give a man a fish, you feed him for a day. You teach him how to fish, you feed him for a lifetime. Well, the Democrat Party has been giving black people fish forever. Just giving us fish. So, it's a few of us that have been strong enough to break that cycle. So I ain't saying every black person. But overall, if you let somebody know ahead of time that if they fall, you're gonna pick them up. They ain't gonna be scared to fall. They not gonna do whatever is necessary not to fall because they know that if I fall, the Democrat got me. They're gonna feed me, they're gonna pay my bills, they're gonna help me out, you know, but if you know that if I fall, I'm on my own, it's a good chance it'll be harder for you to fall. You're gonna do everything in your power to make sure that you have what you need. And I believe that the Democrat Party with their policies have made black people overall weak, dependent. And that's not a good way to be, dependent on anybody. We should be self-sufficient. Which I'm not speaking for all black people because a lot of us have broken that Democrat, that spill. I'm one of them. I don't want nothing from you. Just get out of my way. Let me work. Stop taxing the hell out of me every chance you get. And I'm going to be all right. Leave me alone. And as I get older, it's like I'm thinking more conservative. Not the racist, bigoted conservatism like Rush Limbaugh. I'm talking about conservative as in, as they say, pull yourself up by your bootstrap. Now, I ain't talking about people that need help. There's some people you got handicapped, elderly. There's, all, there's people that need help. I know grown, able-bodied men that's on food stamps. Grown strapping bucks on food stamps. I know a guy that was once a friend of mine that been to school four times, maybe five, on grants just to get the little grant money and, and never get a job. Just go to school, get the money, and, and quit. And he do that over and over again. Saw as hell. Ain't nothing wrong with him. He get food stamps, all that. And I'm like, but well, well, damn. That's not good, man. I, that's why I say we are... And then you look at your boy Joe Biden, he was supposed to. He already knew ahead of time he wasn't going to be able to do it. And he knew that he was going to just blame the Republican. 
about the student loan forgiveness. He knew he wasn't going to be able to get that through, but decided to say it. If it's going to get you to vote for it, I just want to get in. I don't care. You know, it don't matter. I don't care about y'all for real. I just want to have that on my resume that I was the president of the United States. I'm going to say whatever I need to say to do it. He knew he wasn't going to be able to do that. But all he got to do is blame the Republican, blank, and put it on racism. And, that, and that's that's the biggest thing that Democrats like to throw out there, uh, racism. Every, everything racism. Get y'all in a brouhaha or they discriminate racism. Vote for the Democrat. We're going we to protect you from the big, bad, racist Republican. Now, don't get it twisted. I'm not either one. I'm, I'm independent, not Republican or Democrat. I'm, I'm voting for who I think got the best interest of me at hand. And for me, that's the person who's going to chill with all them taxes, cut some of them regulations, and get out of my way, man. Let me work. Let me do my thing. I don't need your help. I just need you to get out of my way. You're, you're, you're governing too much. So, looking at this Joe Biden dude, man, if that's what we got, I, I, I'm not voting Democrat. I know I'm, I might lose family members or friends or whatever, but hey, it is what it is. I want what's best for my people, what's best for myself. Get up, you got, you got yourself. We gotta, we gotta maintain for ourselves, man. We can't. The, the government ain't gonna do. It. Don't let the Democrat keep lying to you. They are not for us. They are against us. They want you out of the way. They don't want you. When, when you speak, let's like just say racist, right? We, they always call it the Republican racist. But what's really racist about? It? Let, me, let me let me point some out to you that the Democrats want, and tell me if that's not racist. They want black people in a position of where we ain't trying to do nothing. We, we, they want us in a position of where we okay with taking them the handouts that they give us. That way that we ain't gonna try to go get an education. We ain't gonna try to better ourselves. Therefore, we ain't taking none of their job because we qualified for them because we done went, got off our ass and got our education, got ourselves together, we done, we done worked hard and worked our way up. Now we competing with them for jobs. That's the racist right there. The one that want to keep me on their titty. The one that want to keep me waiting on handouts and depending on them to help pay my bills, to help feed me, to get me in that mindset the way I'm just, oh, I'm content with that for the rest of my life. That's racist right there. When they don't want you to have to compete with them. They want you down at the bottom, not even trying. So they're going to keep getting your hand out. If you keep let somebody know you're going to help them up when they fall. They're going to keep falling. And they want you. They want us to keep falling, man. Think about it. The more educated we get, the more we're going to be vying for them top paying jobs. They don't care what you're working at Taco Bell and, and, you know, a 50-year-old man working at Taco Bell. Them kid job. They don't care with that, though. But, so therefore, they'll keep on handing you. You know, they, they got places where you can get your bills paid. You can do all this and that. And I've been knowing this all my life. This is something that, that's been... Spread around the black community, you know, they, they paying your bill over here, such and such. They get an extra stamp for this. They doing this. They doing that. They help, you know, that's not helping us, man. Open your eyes. That is not helping us. If you give a man a fish, you feed him for one day. You teach him how to fish, you feed him for a lifetime. The Democrats ain't teaching us how to fish, man. The one of us that learned how to fish, we had to learn on our own. We had to break that cycle and get out here on our own and grind and hustle and open our eyes to the fact that, of the, that scheme that they ran against us, to keeping us content with just getting by. Here, here you go, here go your steps, here go your, here go your welfare, here go whatever else we get, what else you need? We get whatever you need, as long as you don't try to better yourself. That's what a Democrat is to me, man. And we gotta let it go, people. We gotta let it be, I ain't tell you what Trump party be, I'm, like I said, I'm independent, I'm not Democrat or Republican. I look at the candidates, I overlook the bullshit that the media be talking because they more liberal and Democrat-led because if you look at it right now, our economy is in shambles. Our economy is a mess right now. If Donald Trump was in office right now, the media would be blasting him. Oh, he done fucked up the economy. The economy is no, it's, oh, we're in, a we're in a recession right now. But you ain't gonna hear that on the news, on the media. They're quiet about it because the boy, Joe Biden, is in the White House. If that was Donald Trump, man, you'll hear it all over the... They'll be sounding the alarm about how bad this economy is. I know it's bad. I'm a trucker. We know firsthand when the economy is in the tank because we ain't hauling nothing. So if we ain't hauling nothing, that means people ain't spending nothing. But you don't hear that on the news. 
I guarantee if, if Trump was in office, man, you would hear about it every day. They won't, they wouldn't rest. Can't trust the media. The same media that if a little black boy get killed, first thing they gonna do is bring up his past. You know, he got caught shoplifting when he was in the fifth grade. You know, to try to uh, belittle, make him look bad, so that if the cop who killed him, they, they, like he had a reason to kill him, we can't trust that media, man. Them, them folk lying. They, they had to believe in Trump. With, with this and the Trump ain't he's a racist. You think Joe Biden ain't seriously? Anyway, man, I'm I'm, I'm gonna let y'all I'm gonna leave y'all with that. And you, you feel how you want to feel? You know, I know I might lose some people, but hey, I, I keep I keep it real. So y'all have a, 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 the rest of your days to start a rain over here. Please like, subscribe. Even if you don't, you don't agree with what I'm saying, help me out, man. I'm just trying to do something. You know, just I, I like what I'm, I like it. I love it. To be honest with you, thank you.